that he commit not any one of these. Yeah, child sacrifices. They're into this. Yeah. Look. Yeah, George Soros. Yeah. George Soros, Bush, Obama, all part of the same team. The Rothschilds. Yeah, they do these things. Guess what? That was a, that was a fire son sacrifice today. The Moab missile shot off. Yeah. So the ones that died there from that from that bomb, that was they were sacrificed to <laughs> Satan. That's really all. All this blood that was spilled, you spilled the blood of the saints first and foremost. The children of Israel, you took the so-called Negroes, kidnapped them <coughs> from the west coast of Africa, brought them over here, put them in slavery. Then you took the indigenous, the northern kingdom, the native tribes, destroyed them. Then you took the Caribbean islands. You went to the Tainos, destroyed them, murdered them. That was all blood. That's why the scriptures say, oh, wait, we're going to bring that out. We're going to bring that out. We're going to bring it out. We're going to bring it out. You thought it was going down, man. There's nothing you can do about it. You had your time to rule, right? And now it's your time to go down. It's your time to go down. Ezekiel 35 and 6. You love blood, right? Uh, Illuminati? Illuminati, huh? You love, you love blood, right? You love child sacrifices and, and murdering people and, and bankrupting countries and calling and causing world homelessness. You fucking pieces of shit. Guess what? All this wickedness that you're doing, the Rothschilds, the Lord sees you. You goddamn devils. They really do these things, man. They really do this, man. And don't worry, they're going to show their horns. Right now they're hiding and they're being exposed to the Spirit of the, spirit of the Lord. But real soon, they, 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 they're just going to show their horns to the, horns to the whole world. When they connect, collapse the economy and they implement that chip, the RFID chip. And they're going to be killing that Man, they're going to be going left and right. Hey, this, we're going to bring that out. Revelations 12 and 12. He knows that he had but a short time. The devil. The devil knows he has but a short time. It's not it's all about spiritual demon Satan. No. Was, there is a spiritual demon Satan. But there's a physical counterpart on earth taking orders from spiritual demon Satan. His physical sons on earth, which are the Rothschilds elites, the Edomites, man. That's what they do what they do. Because they're the devil. They have the spirit, it's the serpent in them. They are Cain. Ezekiel 35 and 5. Because thou had had a perpetual hatred and shed the blood of the children of Israel by the force of the, of the sword in the time of their calamity, in the time that their iniquity had an end. Therefore, as I live, save the Lord Yahweh, I will prepare unto thee blood, and blood shall pursue thee. Said thou, since thou had not hated blood, even blood shall pursue thee. Thus will I make Mount Seir most desolate and cut off from it. From, come up, cut off from it him that passeth and him that returneth. And I will fill his mountains with his slain men and thy hills and in thy valleys. And in all thy rivers shall they fall that are slain with the sword. I will make the perpetual desolation and thy city shall not return. And ye shall know that I am the Lord. So since you love blood so much, guess what? Blood is going to pursue you. And guess what? David was a man at the most highest heart. David couldn't build the father's temple. Why? Because he had so much blood in his hands. And David's going to have his hands on you devils. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're so obsessed with blood, right? Your blood going to run. Your blood going to run, man. In the kingdom of heaven. And we don't give a fuck if you put this in the media. Please put us in the media. Please. Please put us in the media. And you're going to... No, no, no. Fuck you. The father's going to put us in the media because this word's going to blow up. We're going to go to the gates of the nobles, man. He's going to give us that spiritual power. And we're going to exalt, and we're going to exalt, we're going to publish, we're doing that now, we're publishing the Lord's name, Yahweh, Yahweh Shai. We're going to get that spiritual power, and they shall believe in the, in the day of thy power, man, they shall be willing in the day of thy power. Psalms 1 and 10. We're going to get that power, and this is going to, man, the most High is dramatic, man, he's very theatrical. This is, we're living in a movie right now. The transition of, of, of the power from Esau to Jacob, we in the we in the time of that now. The saints shall take the kingdom. Lord setting up the government now, the new government that's going to be ruling the planet Earth and the universe. And your government's going down. You Rothschild's Legion, satanic, demonic, evil, pagan society is going down. And you all the nations are going to serve us in the, in the kingdom to come. The children of Israel, God's chosen people, the true royalty, the true Jews, the true princes and kings of the earth, man. Uh, 30, uh, numbers 35 and 33. So ye shall not pollute the land wherein ye are. For blood defileth the land, and the land cannot be cleansed of the blood that is shed therein, but by the blood of him that shed it. So your blood's going to be spilt, man. 
you're going to be broken into pieces. You're so, you're so obsessed with fire and sun cycle. You're so obsessed with the sun. Like you have that song, Black Hole Sun, won't you come? You're so obsessed with the sun. You're so obsessed with all these pagan, uh, demonic Canaanite deities. Well, guess what? Since you're so obsessed with fire and the sun, America is going to be burnt up with fire, with nuclear fire. It's going to be hot like a sun, a million degrees, man, from California, New York. She's just so obsessed with fire and sun sacrifices, man, and worshiping these demonic evil entities. You fucking pieces of shit. That's what you are. Then you got people that get mad because we so-called curse. Well, it's not even a curse anyway. Shit, bitch, is not a curse, man. Shit's in the Bible. Don't you know that? Esau, don't you know Esau, you're going dis to disappear like your own shit? And after a thousand years, after a thousand years of hardcore slavery, we're going to burn your ass the fuck up. Yeah. You're going to be vanquished. So you're so obsessed with fire, right? You're so obsessed with fire and being burnt and, and burning people. Guess what? All that fire and all that wickedness you're doing is, is going to engulf you, literally, man. Because after a thousand years of slavery, we're going to burn up you Rothschilds. You elites. We're going to burn you up. And you're going to be, you're going to, you're going to vanquish like you shit. Like dung, like the scripture says in Job. Look at this shit. Look at this. They go in. Look at this. Androgynous demon. Bruce Transgender. One Woman of the Year Award. It's androgynous demon is an actual deity, an actual entity, man. And that shit is everywhere now. That that homo, that homosexual, effeminate, androgynous demon, that shit is everywhere, man. You'll take the train, you'll take the bus, you look to the left, to the right, you, see, you can't stop. You go to work, you see at least 20 faggots or lesbians. <laughs> Rarely, man. And then you walk around with a beard looking like a man, have that masculine energy, which is power, and then they all look at you bugged out. They're fucking bugged out. You guys understand? It's fucking yeah. disgusting, man. That's true. I mean, shit, I'll say this. Work, walking to New York every fucking day to work, being exposed to mad people. I see that shit on the regular. I'm working in the restaurant industry. It's disgusting. It's fucking real disgusting. Real soon it's going to be illegal to be a man. It, it is like that now. Yeah. He, you know? Esau, Esau will ban sex if he could. But he needs slaves, of course. But I'm just making a point. This devil's the, he's the devil. He'll tax you every time you bust a nut. He'll tax you. This fucking devil, man. By understanding the ancient origins of the religion of the Illuminati as being connected to Egyptian and Canaanite theology, you will better understand what I am about to present to you and how this satanic belief system ties everything that we have discussed in this video together. And guess what? Yeah, Alex the Crawley said that. Sex magic. Yeah. Sex magic, man. Yeah. It's real stuff. Why do you think they have women being promiscuous, man? Sleeping with different men. Because that, that pushes out demonic entity, demonic energy. That promiscuous spirit is a demonic entity, man. These women these women have demons on them. You see a woman dressing with her ass and titties out? She got demons on her. Dressing like a prostitute? In the kingdom of heaven, we ain't going to have that. The Lord's going to put a righteous spirit in our people, men, women, and children. He's going to restore the house. Our men are going to be in order. Our women going to be in order. You ain't going to see the madness now. When you see a woman walking down the block, that's, why, that's, a, lost, that's a lost daughter of Zion, man. You see a black, Latino, American woman with her ass and titties out. She's royalty, man. But she got so much demons on her, she's dressed like a goddamn whore. But whose fault is that? Esau. Through being under these heathens, this is what happens. You get, we be destroyed being under these heathens, following their ways. And we're, and we're worse than we've ever been, man. That's why we got to get the fuck out of here. We need an exodus out of this God 